Where's the memento now? That's my question. Oh, is it the bunny? I bet it's the bunny. Yep. Alright, let's do the bunny. Break the seal around the bunny. And prepare the memento. Okay, let's see. Oh dear. Okay. Um. Hmm. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. If I start with that, that'll get rid of this and that. These two will still be a problem. Well, actually, yeah, if I start with that, that'll wipe out this row except for this. No, that's not good. I don't think I want to do that. If I start with this one, okay, the ideal is five moves. If I start with this one, that'll wipe out that guy and put two in there. I, I have no clue. Maybe I should just start doing things and hope it works. That's always a good plan, right? Okay, let's try this. So then I can take out that row, but... I don't think that'll actually help that much. What if I flip the diagonal? Aha! And then flip that, and then flip that, and that. There we go. Alright. Travel. Activate. Question mark? A bunny. River? Alright, we have control. Um, can I examine anything in here? No. I can just follow him. Downstairs. Ooh, we can examine this. New boxes of plain paper. Uh-oh, I think I know where this is going. Yes, we're going to be making bunnies, huh? The piano. An old baby grand piano. How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? Who knows, but I bet it'd be a piece of cake for the TARDIS. <laughs> what? Not really, you can't even get it through its door. Mmm, true. Wow, Doctor Who debates. Well, that settles it. Moving pianos is a pain in the arse for everybody. It'd probably take an entire episode to get it inside. Oh, <laughs> wow, you guys are silly. I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. Me neither. It sounds pretty epic. Wow, that would be awesome if such a thing actually happened. That would make me so happy. You went out for a haircut this early in the morning? What are you making there? Rabbits. Did you see the rabbit that I left for you? Yeah. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. Um, it was yellow. What else? A bit puffy. And? Well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know how else to describe it. You're acting strange, River. Is something wrong? River?
I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. I think I know of her condition, but this is a rather odd this is rather odd even for that. You think she's do you? Perhaps, who knows? But like you said, she's not our client. Why don't you tell me what she is? Let's just get what we're paid for over with. Okay, search that. Many long strands of orange hair. The platypus. Ooh, that's the memento, okay. Will we get to find out what the platypus is about? That would be great, because it confuses me. I don't understand the platypus. Okay, um, what else am I looking for? Wait, go back in there. Is there really nothing else in here? Oh wait, no, I can look at the bunny. So this is the day she started it, huh? Yep. Alright. Let's break this. Let the guy do it, he's funny. Neil, you do it. <laughs> Alright, prepare this one. Let's see, what do we got this time? Okay. Uh, I see how to do this. This one's easy. Yay! Okay, I always forget that I have to click on it again. Activate. Let's find out about this platypus, hopefully. It's in the car. Examine the platypus, maybe? Mm, I guess not. You can go up, though. Let's go up. Do we walk towards the house? Or where the house should be? Okay, we got an orb. That, But I missed one back there, then. That's not good. Let's go back. I think, shouldn't the one there pop in first? Is there anything that I can examine here? What about walking over here? Nope. Can I go down the road? How far can I go down the road is the better question. Not very. Oh man, it's like we're in Silent Hill. The road is out ahead. As well. Okay then. Uh, walk up there then, I guess. Let's try heading. Can I go this way first? Is it possible to walk that way? Not really. Okay then, go up back up there. Maybe it'll pop in elsewhere. So I can go up here. No, that doesn't seem to do me much good. Alright, let's walk towards the memory. If that little blue sphere becomes a problem, I'll deal with it later. Okay, red arrow, go. Exactly. Where's Johnny? This is where the house used to be, isn't it? The house that never should have been. I mean, really, what is it about unusually high and dangerous peoples that attract people? Or places, rather. Receive note. Acrophobia. What's this note? Something that Johnny and River apparently didn't have. <laughs> High and dangerous places. That was what that said. Uh, okay, well. Go through the log. 
Okay, let's go through the log. We can go back across the log. Okay, go up this log. Oh, we got something good. Oh, and the blue one popped in. That's good. I was worried about the blue one. Is this why... Is that why you approached me back then? Yeah. What about now? I suppose it's just a part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too relevant now, but Izzy and I should tell you the truth. It shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. Or I shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. What is that? A hacky sack? Can you throw this as far as where Anya's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? go. River. Are you insane? Get away from there. I think his memory isn't too far from the last. Think they may be, may be connected? Probably. Can I walk over to them? Yeah, jump over. What's this? Oh, that's the memento. Okay. Get river. Why did she cut her hair anyway? I like long hair. <laughs> Who cares what you like? Alright, let's hop to the next memory. Alright, we gotta prepare this. Oh, this is, this is simple. And this one. There we go. Uh, oh yeah, I have to click on it. Activate. Okay. Everyone with it is different, John. Just because she and I share the syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. But you must be able to help somehow. Everything was okay at first, but now she's even more aloof than before. Even when we're in the same room, she's never really there. It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, for her, but many of us do long for connections. Though, being able to articulate it is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it, it doesn't mean she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. That's pretty difficult to do day in and day out. I know. Wait. But why do you seem so normal, Izzy? I mean, you don't have the same condition. Don't you have the same condition? For one, I was, I was diagnosed when I was still young. With effort, it's not impossible to acquire a guise of social norms systematically. But, you know what? I both envy and pity River. Me, I'm an actress because I've been doing it all my life. Not only on stage, but off stage and at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. If it's, it's the only way for me to be normal. But River, she never did that. She remained an outcast and refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if it was by choice or by limit, 
whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore. And then I realize that it's too late. The Isabel that people know of is all an act, and the real me has long become a stranger. I think in the end, I just envy her. Is she autistic? Huh, I've never met a woman with it before. Then technically, you still haven't met one. <laughs> this isn't part of our business. Let's move. Okay. Um, let's see. What can we see here? Is there anything to search? Oh, there's a person. Okay, search the person. The world would be a lot more beautiful if people just remembered faces more. Oh, I get it. This is the stuff that he remembers, and he doesn't remember all of these people. She's the only one that's important. Anything new today? No. What are you rereading there? The Emperor's New Clothes. I loved this when I was young. Still do, huh? Of course. Just for different reasons. When I was a kid, I loved the Animorph series. <laughs> I know, your mother gave you a book from it as our wedding present. Heh. Yeah, that was one odd wedding present. I guess I was pretty obsessed with it when I was a kid. Why haven't you read them since? Hmm? I saw them. They're collecting dust in the garage. Well, I just grew out of them, I guess. I mean, they're children's books. What's wrong with reading children's books? They're comforting. I suppose so. I think I'm going to get this one. Hey, can I move? Oh, I can move. Okay. I wasn't sure if the cutscene was still going on. Is there anyone else that I can look at? Oh, I can interact with him. Oh man, there's a whole bunch of him. Talk to this one. I'm not yours, you're not mine. Be my anti-Valentine. Hey, River. This one's not that corny. <laughs> River? this one but what about David's he's my favorite character uh, I don't know what are you talking what are you talking about Animorphs have you read it no yes <laughs> really <laughs> sort of oh oh do you know what animal is David's main morph um oh geez I don't know that I never read those books. I just know about them. Uh... Let's do rabbit, because that seems to be the... Oh, no, I can't do rabbit. Okay. <laughs> He's not a rabbi. <laughs> no. How do I go back? Delete. Delete. No, oh, there we go. Okay, delete. <laughs> um... Okay. Damn it, I need to put something. <laughs> Not right by. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to think of even what I saw in those covers way back then, and I don't remember at all. It's been so long. That was like third grade. I'm 22. It probably doesn't matter, right? How many letters did I have? Five. I'm trying to think of five letter animals. And I'm failing miserably.
Let's just put dog. That doesn't sound right. Don't worry, I'll find it out for you. Oh, do I actually have to know that stuff now? Okay, let's talk to this one. Okay, go talk to them. Oh, there we go. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Tobias Hawk, Rachel Grizzly, Jake Tiger, Marco Gorilla, David Cobra, Cassie Wolf. Why? Oh, just wondering. You could have just Googled it. Well, I was going to, but I decided not to cheat. I have my other computer open right here. Do you know what animal is David's main morph? Yes, Cobra. Cobra. Okay. Oh yeah, a cobra. I really wish they kept the old covers instead of these plain sheets. Those were cool. Okay. Um, do I look at them again? I guess not. Oh, there's the memento. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, goodness. That bar down the middle is going to be a pain. Hmm. Because I don't have a diagonal that way. Hmm. Ideal is five. Let's just try flipping that. I can, if I flip, I don't think I want to flip that one yet. Shut up, guinea pigs. I'm busy. Uh, I don't like where this is going. Did I mess up already? Dusty, be quiet. So if I do that. Um, oh, I see. Then I can flip this, flip this, and flip this. There we go. All right. Okay, let's activate this one. Note Animorphs. Oh, let's read it. No, 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 I want to read the note first. Animorphs. Johnny's favorite children book, childhood books. Okay. Um, yeah, let's activate the memento. Let's see where we end up next. All right, we're back to... Adulthood. But not middle-agedness. Aw, oh, everyone's leaving already? But I just got here. Seems to happen to you a lot at parties. <laughs> oh, go save your childish, childish jabs for the insecure. Oh god, I love him. Okay, well, I actually think I'm going to go ahead and save this memory for next time. Because this is already pretty long and it's kind of late. <laughs> so, um, yeah. That was really awesome. I'm really enjoying this so far. This is fantastic. This guy is a sweetheart. Anyway, um, yeah, so next time we'll pick up with this memory. And um, yeah, until then, I hope you guys enjoyed this and hope to see you next time for more To the Moon. Until then, goodbye everyone.